What is going on, everybody? It is Mike. Welcome back to Tech 24-7 TV. Today, we are going hands-on with Apple's two new Apple Watch Series 6. I got it in product red and blue metallic. Spoiler alert, it's beautiful. Let's get to unboxing. Welcome back to Tech 24-7 TV, where we bring you the best in unboxing and product reviews so you can make informed buying decisions. So if you like product review videos, just like this one right now, make sure you are subscribed with notifications because I have a whole bunch of iOS 14, iPadOS 14, and watchOS 7 content planned. Now let's get on with the unboxing. So I ordered two Apple Watch Series 6s. I have the Blue Metallic and the Blue Metallic is to be in a size 9 and I measured my wrist using Apple's tool that's on their website. I put on the braided loop. Lo and behold, it is too big but it's still beautiful nonetheless. I gotta figure out what the exchange process looks like, but hopefully I can get a new band sometime soon. Now, both the Apple Watch Series 6 I have here is the cellular version. I plan on replacing my Apple Watch Series 5 sometime soon. I'm gonna give it to a friend or family member, and now it's even easier because of Apple Watch family setup. Maybe my dad needs a new watch, who knows, we'll see. That would be great. Both Apple Watches are gonna be the Series 6 GPS plus cellular, and they come in at 529 and 579 respectively from Apple. I bought the aluminum version this year. This is the titanium. Normally don't resell my Apple watches. I usually just keep them for a couple years. I use them kind of to do testing year over year, but regardless. Now opening up this packaging, you see here that on the blue, it is gonna be just a standard color. You open it up, you see the color of the watch indicated on the interior wrapping. And we, here we see the, uh, the Apple watch itself and the band. Here we see the watch, it contains all the same material. Now I can tell you that, that the material that's being used on the sleeve to hold the Apple Watch is gonna be a little bit different. Last year was more of like a, almost like a soft cloth material that you'd find on something to like clean your glasses. This year it's a, it feels like paper actually, uh, which makes sense because they've re or redesigned their entire manufacturing process and everything that's going into the consumer materials is gonna be 100% recycled material. Now, for me, I really love both colors. I think the blue metallic looks really good, especially under light. When light hits it, it just kind of reflects. It looks really dark blue, it looks black, and the braided band is awesome. I really like it. It is kind of hard to take on and off. Uh, again, this is a little bit big on me, but uh, I think for, I'm gonna choose which one to keep because I'm not gonna keep both. That doesn't make any sense. Why would I need three Apple Watches? Opening up the packaging, there's not a whole lot that's changed from the Apple Watch Series 5 to the Series 6 other than the removal of the inbox five watt charger. Now this is only gonna to apply to anyone who's buying the aluminum version. You still get the five watt charger when you go ahead and buy the Edition, the Hermes, or even the Sport. Other than aesthetics, there's not a whole lot that has changed from even an exterior perspective if you compare these Apple Watch Series 5 versus Series 6. You have the same case size, you have the same button size, all the buttons function exactly the same. Really, again, there's not too much difference. All of the differences that you are gonna see in a Series 6 is gonna to have to do with the internal of what the Apple Watch is capable of. First, you're gonna have the blood oxygen sensor. Now, this is a sensor that is designed to go ahead and read your blood oxygen level on your wrist after a short 15 second session. Now, this is gonna be pretty cool because you can use this as a way of go ahead and gauging your health, even though, quote unquote, it is not a medical device. Second, you are getting an always on display that's two and a half times brighter than the Series 5, along with the S6 system on a chip, which is gonna be 20% faster. You're still gonna get the same all day battery life. Matter of fact, I'm testing mine right now. And if you wanna see that in the full review, make sure you are subscribed with notifications so you can get alerted when that content drops. Now, it's still a little early to see which one I'm gonna go ahead and keep. I certainly am not keeping both. I'm not giving Apple that much money. Uh, I do like the dark blue metallic. It looks really, really subtle, especially when the light hits it. You can't tell if it's gonna be that, uh, like a dark black or a titanium colored, or if it's that dark blue. The red though looks mm, beautiful. Uh, I would definitely suggest checking out it if you can. Now, I also would suggest, you know, even if you're ordering the Apple Watch, the braided loop, if you have measured your wrist, don't be surprised if it's gonna be a little bit too big. I would actually err on the side of caution and I would go down even a size further because it's gonna stretch out over time. You know, make sure you're following me on Twitter because that is where I'm putting all my comments on the new products that are coming out. I am Mike, this is Tech 24 7 TV. Hit like, hit subscribe, and I'll talk to you in the next one.